All right, I'm always interested in any new feature that's going to help me save time. And in this case, SEOwriting.ai has released a new feature that uh, I think is going to help you out immensely in your social media marketing. If you look up here, there's this checkbox, it's called syndication. When I click it, all of a sudden, what do we have? We have a Twitter thread. So you can go on X or, or Twitter, whatever you wanna call it, and you have a whole thread that you can use to promote this article that you just wrote about Merlot. And so it gives you that. It gives you a LinkedIn post. All of these social media artifacts are written based on the article that you had seowriting.ai create. So you don't have to do any additional prompting. You don't have to do anything extra to get this information. It's just done automatically, which is a huge time saver. So here's a LinkedIn post. Here's a great Facebook post. So if you have a Facebook page, you can promote your new blog post on Merlot there. This is a huge time saver. It writes a complete newsletter. So you can go and take this. You just copy it, go into whatever tools you use to send out your newsletters. And there you go. It's got a place right here, a placeholder for the link to your blog post, your name, company, whatever you choose to put in there. If you use WhatsApp, it's got a WhatsApp message that you can send out promoting this new blog post. And then of course, if you're using Pinterest, you have the text that you can use for Pinterest as well. You just have to create the image. It doesn't create the Pinterest image for you. Although one thing I plan to suggest to SEO writing is to take one of these images uh, from the post and turn it into a Pinterest sized post. So one that's ready to use for Pinterest and then include it in this section here. We'll see if we'll see if they take that as advice and do that, but that would even make it more time saving. So if you've seen any of my other videos, you know, I'm really big on holistic blogging. I think it's really important to take it advantage of social media platforms because that's how you're going to boost more traffic and get more people looking at your blog. So this is a great feature to have. It's very easy to use. So let's look and see how I created all of these different social media posts. Before I show you how easy it is to create these social media posts, I'm going to share a bonus feature that SEO writing uh, has available to you as well. So hang on, you're gonna see that as soon as we take a look at how to create those social media posts. So I'm gonna go back to the article itself. This is all the information I put in to generate that article. The most important part of this is going to be right here. It's called syndication. So this is for creating marketing materials based on the article for all these various platforms. So again, Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook, email newsletter, WhatsApp, and Pinterest. All you need to do is just say, for Twitter, you can have a single thread or a short thread, or if you don't do Twitter, you just say no. Same thing here, LinkedIn, yes or no. Facebook post, yes or no. Email newsletter, yes or no. WhatsApp message, yes or no. And then of course, Pinterest, yes or no. Now, if you want to, you can add a link to a page. I always use placeholder, but you can go with no link, you can do a WordPress link, you can do a custom link. So that's up to you. I typically just do a placeholder link and put it in later. So let's get on to this bonus feature. Now, it doesn't have anything to do with social media, but it is something that's just been added to SEO writing. I wanna make you aware of it if you haven't noticed it. So it is some additional instructions around creating AI images. You can put in additional instructions. So what they show as an example is, you know, add a character wearing a red jacket or depict a rainy city street. So for the article, I said, show bottles and glasses of red wine only. So that's what I did. Now they have a brand name feature where you can enter a brand name. So let's say, for just sake of example, your wine.com. Well, you can put in wine.com in here, and what the AI image generator tries to do is put that brand name on the image 
if there's a suitable place to do that. Now, I haven't been having great luck with it, and I will just tell you, it wouldn't be something that I would probably use a lot, but these additional instructions I would use. Even ideogram.ai, which I have a video on, you know, that particular tool, which is known for being able to take your text inputs and put that on an AI image, just has difficulty at times as well. And that's really what its forte is. So for now, I probably wouldn't use brand name. You can experiment with it, see if it works for you. It works for me about, oh, maybe 30% of the time I'm happy with it. So these are two new features that I really think you'll like with seowriting.ai. And make sure and check out these two videos that you see on your screen right now for more seowriting.ai information.